Hey guys, it's Erin. Today's video is going to be what's in my carry-on. Definitely recommend a backpack because they're much easier to carry around with you. So the first thing I like to keep in the front pouch is some chewing gum because I always get plopped ears when I take off and land. So I definitely recommend some chewing gum. The next thing I like to bring is some sunglasses because you don't know where you're going unless you do. And I just like to bring sunglasses in case it's really sunny so I don't get blinded. The next thing I like to bring is a wallet. I've just got some money in it. Usually if I'm going to a different country, I won't be able to use the money. But I can use it for snacks and stuff in the airport when we're in going somewhere else or if I'm coming in back from holiday and I don't have any food I can buy a snack before leaving. I also like to carry lip balm because my lips get very very dry on an airplane ride. I like to bring some sort of snack. I've got some hairy both strawberries here. They're very good. And then the last things that I keep in the front pouch are some pens, pencils, and a rubber. Just to keep me entertained, but I've got something else in there for you. So in the main pouch, there's a lot more because it's much bigger. But the first thing there is in it, I have my wireless headphones so I can listen to music and stuff on the plane because... I get very bored and there's not much to do and the earphones are very uncomfortable for me. They don't quite fit me so I really like to carry headphones. The next thing I like to keep is a notebook that I can draw on with the pens and pencils and rubbers that I brought in the front pouch and just a book that I can read on the plane. This book is The World of Norm um, May Contain Butts. And it's from Jonathan Mears. So I'm reading that. Then I like to keep my charger for my iPod, which I also keep in the front pouch, but I can't show you because I'm actually filming with it right now. But I like to keep the charger for that and hope that I can use it in the country. But if I can't, I'll just buy a wall plug there. Then I like to keep my hairbrush in case my hair gets very messy during the plane ride. I also like to keep a water bottle. Usually there's water in it, but I you when if you know when you're going through security you can't have water, so you have to fill it up. So I just bring a water bottle and then fill it up when I get through the security. The next thing I like to bring is a small pillow, one that will fit into my bag because I need something small, and a blanket. If I'm on a long plane ride, they will provide blankets and pillows, but if I'm on a shorter ride, they won't necessarily, and their blankets aren't the warmest and their pillows aren't the comfiest, so I like to bring my own just in case, keep me extra warm because sometimes they can be very cold. I also like to bring some socks in case my feet get cold. I bring a normal pair and a very fluffy pair. And then the last thing I bring is my bag with just different things in it. The different things in it are I've got some lotion because your hands and stuff get very dry on airplanes, so I need some lotion. I like to keep some soap. Just in case there isn't soap, so I can wash my hands during, because you might get very dirty hands during a plane ride, because there's a lot of things you can touch, so soap to wash your hands. Then I like to bring one minute. I like to bring my toothbrush and toothpaste 
and the reason it was taking me so long to get out. So I have my toothbrush in a plastic bag because I don't want all those little hairs and dirt stuff getting on it. Like, you know, when you take it out and then all that gunk on the bottom of your bag gets onto your toothbrush. That's not what I says. It won't make your teeth any cleaner. It'll just make them dirtier. So I keep a toothbrush and toothpaste in my carry-on so I can brush my teeth on the plane. Then I like to bring just a spray. I don't, yeah, just spray. A small one if I can because they'll fit. I don't need that much. You can buy some when I get there. Then I like to keep my deodorant just in that bag too. I keep a little washcloth in these. When you put them in water, they go bigger, but they're much bigger when you fold them up and put them in your bag. So if you can get these small ones that are really small, then when you put them in water, they'll grow bigger. But um, it's just so that it's not taking a lot of space. So I have a lot more space because they're quite small. Then I've just got some face wipes to clean my face because it might get really dirty on a plane ride. So I like to keep some face wipes in there. I like to keep another lip balm, not in the front pouch, just for in there. And then I've just got a couple of hair baubles and stuff so that I can keep my hair out of my face. So that is it for this video. I hope you've enjoyed. I hope if you've forgotten anything to bring in your bag, you can maybe use some of these things. You can take these in your bag. I take this bag on planes or cars and I hope you've enjoyed. Subscribe, give a big thumbs up. If I get 20 thumbs up by the time I go back to school, which is in two weeks, I will do two videos the week that I go back to school. So subscribe, give me a thumbs up, and comment what you want for a future video, or comment what where's your favorite place to go on holiday, or where you went on holiday this year if you went on holiday. And yeah, thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Bye. See you next time.